Snails are mollusks, meaning they are invertebrate. An invertebrate is an animal without a spine. There are two types of snails, ones with lungs and ones with gills. The one we are looking at is one of the lung. As you can see, it's got a shell and is relatively small. Most snails are herbivores, but some eat meat. Those ones usually live in water. Fossils show evidence that snails evolved more than 600 million years ago. That's longer than the dinosaurs. Don't waste your time trying to tell a male and female snail apart. They're hermaphrodites, meaning they're male and female. So when they're mating, they both lay eggs and both send sperm. As the snail moves, it leaves a trail of slime as seen. This allows it to easily move across any type of terrain without injuring its body. Depending on your point of view, snails can be disgusting or can be fascinating, like to Miss Vitamin Jones. The average lifespan of a snail is around 15 years. However, it's believed that some species can live up to 25 years in captivity. A popular misconception is that snails carry harmful bacteria and diseases and that people can become very ill from those. That's not true. So you don't need to worry if you touch some of their slime or items they have come into contact with. You do need to wash your hands well with soap and water. Though Although most people are familiar with land snails, most snail species actually live in the sea. Snails are not slugs with shells. In fact, if you try and take a shell off a snail to turn into a slug, it would probably die. Snails are considered delicacies in some parts of the world, like France. However, if you ask a farmer or a gardener, they probably would tell you that a snail is a pest, as they often eat crops and their um, hard-earned fruits of their labour. However, to be humane, some gardeners and farmers release the snails. Snails have one giant foot they use to move with, as you can see over there. Snails have a tongue called a radula. It's got lots of tooth-like things on it, and in fact, around 25,000 of it. It uses the radula to break down food so it can digest it. Because of its slowness, the snail has sometimes been seen as a symbol of laziness. Snails mate by shooting love darts into each other. This is rather unusual as no other creature quite makes like the snail. As you can see, the love dart looks rather weird. It's like a needle sticking out of a sack. Love darts are usually 7 to 11 millimeters in length and are stung into the partner's foot during mating. It is even suggested that the ancient myth of Cupid's arrows might be based on early observations of the love dart behavior of the land species Helix aspersa.